WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Tuesday, three hours left to go in the trading day. We got markets hanging around negative territory. Dow Jones right now off 109 points, trading 26,618. We have the NASDAQ off 82 points, trading at 79.23. S&P is negative by 20, trading at 29.32. Notes and bonds, slightly higher price, lower yield. The 10-year up one tick right now, 127.31. We have the 30 are up 12 ticks, 155.26. Dollar index up 328 ticks at 95.815. And how about Bitcoin? Up 462 bucks at 11,319. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow. Excuse me, and quite an acceleration. So there is just prior to the market open, 9 a.m. Eastern time. Quite an acceleration from 26,786. We trade down about 150, 160 points, 26,616. As you can see, the market breaking those lows right now, 26,590 in the Dow. S&P's new trading intraday lows, excuse me, right now as we speak, 2927. NASDAQ 100 trading lower for most of the session, not that long ago. 9.30, we're trading at 77.54. You're talking about 114 points from that level, folks. 77.54 to 76.41. And we're, we're not stopping there, maybe. Crude oil, above 58 bucks, barely, trading at 58.01. We get the gold contract with some volatility as well. We got a couple Fed governors out there. We have Bullard talking. Bullard is saying that... At most, one quarter, and this is the action in the currencies as well, and we have Powell coming up as well, but Bullard saying that one quarter would be the most, and I'll pull this up. Let's jump over right now. We'll do a couple headlines to wrap this up. So there's your first headline, stocks declining on rate comments by Fed's Bullard, and the Bullard saying any July rate cut should be limited to a quarter point, so really discounting the possibility of 50 basis points. And then what you also have going on, whoops, that is Bullard, is you're going to have Powell out there talking right now. And there's the case. So Powell reiterating rate cut case has risen amid economic risks. You have Powell making a speech starting at 1 o'clock, I believe, Eastern time. So we should be getting some headlines coming out of there for this hour. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Steve Rhodes coming up right now. And then, of course, Dave White live at 2 o'clock. Tom O'Brien live from 3 till 5. This market escalating. We're now down 140 in the Dow. NASDAQ down 94. S&P's down 23. Stay tuned, folks. Steve Rhodes coming up right now.